Welcome back to the channel guys. It's early in the morning. Uh, we're heading up to see Ryan Scott again from Pure Function, hang out with the boys, take some roller shots with the Supra. Uh, obviously I'm in the truck right now, gassing up. So what we have to do is we have to go to my uncle's house, get my Supra, swap all this camera gear over, and then make the trek up to Waynesboro, Pennsylvania. Uh, it's about a two hour trip. It's Sunday morning, so it shouldn't be too, too bad of a trip. Um, we'll see how it goes. So before we leave, a couple things I need to do. I want to check the vitals, make sure she's got a good amount of oil in her. Um, second off, I want to make sure she starts. It's been probably three weeks since I've started this thing up, so uh, we'll see how that goes. So yeah, I'm a fucking moron, and basically the battery is toast. Um, the sad part is I bought a battery tender for it not too long ago. As you can see, it's never freaking opened the thing. Uh, scatterbrained as usual. So here we are. This is this is not good. No I'm good, no bueno. I'm on my way for that to charge. I'm gonna go ahead and swap out this filter. I don't know if you can tell, this filter's freaking tiny as hell. Uh, Ryan Scott, he actually recommended me get this one. This is the same one he runs. Uh, I don't know if you can tell. Definitely got a lot more surface area. Both are K&N. Uh, this is just a different model number. So hopefully that'll help it breathe a little better and. Maybe add a few more horses on it there. Maybe someone else can help explain this. There's a freaking hole in this freaking filter. It's the weirdest damn thing I've ever seen. It pretty much uh, defeats the whole purpose of a filter right there if you ask me. So maybe someone, maybe one of you guys knows the answer to why the hell this filter had a hole in it. Much better. Oh my gosh, she lives. Yeah, just wasted about an hour just charging this thing up. No bueno. No bueno. No cup holder, so that's nice. It's a little filthy. So filthy. That's real, real nice. Real, real classy. Real classy. Is it real classy? That's what I was going for. That's, that's actually the kind of style I like. Can't All right, guys, it. this may look familiar back here at the Scott Garage, Pure Function. Got a whole crew today. Some beautiful rides. We're actually gonna get out here in a second and take some rolling shots in everybody's cars. Uh, get some drone footage. Get the gimbal out, take some video with that as well. Holy shit! Can I'm trends and functions? What's the meaning of nothing? And my brain waves never stop these fucking assumptions. I'm just a nanny child with a wild sense of views. I got it at you, this nostalgia man made curfew we beat through. Down our visions on our cold, they blurred us so foggy black. Forgot how to react to the truth when it spewed out on me and you. Hold us back like what the fuck is happening to my differences? What's the meaning of really getting up and living, kid? Am I glad I'm Substance business is getting old. Why we bluffing afraid of something? 
Alright, we just got back at Ryan's place. Went out and did some rollers to the other guy's cars. Hopefully we get back out here and do me and Ryan's car here in a bit. We actually came back to make a pit stop. Hungry. Mr. Ryan. George Foreman himself. That's right. Some a little crispy. Some Ombre We talked about that beer and about that merch plug? Uh, yeah, uh, guys, if you want to, uh, if you could, go check out the channel. And uh, if you could do me a favor, go buy some merch. Please, dear Lord, baby Jesus, buy some merch. We were on the highway with him and his BMW and just with back and forth, back and forth. Huh? Oh yeah, professional drivers in Mexico. And just back and forth, back and forth. Motherfucker just goes. Oh, so much fun. What was it, 180? In Mexico, yeah, it was like 180. Yeah, Mexico. Yeah, close to 180, yeah. That's what the driver said. Yeah. They operate in kilometers there, or is it a uh, mile per hour in Mexico? Those American cars. That's the uh, it's American car. We ship it down. I mean, we got money, so I mean, we just ship it places. I mean, that's what we do as Americans. We're all assholes like that. <laughs> so now we're going to take this old girl out, get some rollers of mine, and we're going to take some rollers of Ryan's. Uh, this should be oh, the wait, last. I get to turn this on? Woo! You're going to oh, drive I, it, right? Yeah. Bitch, are you kidding me? Give me this. Just be careful, man. My baby. So donuts, donuts, guys. I got you. <laughs> That was fun. It was short lived, but it was fun. I guess, did your buddy miss the turn or he just intentionally? Uh, he's coming back to the car and his fans aren't kicking on, so his car's overheating now. <laughs> oh, shit. He's like, yeah, my fans aren't kicking on. I'm going home to get another car. I'll be right back. Jeez. What are we doing right now? A vlog for a vlog? I mean, what's going on, bro? This should be a name for that. I mean, double vlogs. So, just got done taking rollers of this and of the uh, MR2, which uh, Nate's standing in front of. Nate, good job, buddy. Shame on you. Shame. Shame. We didn't uh, we didn't get any ch a time to do the actual video rollers. Yeah, which sucks because whatever. Fucking lame. Super lame on your behalf. Extremely lame. <laughs> um, no, but seriously, you got some cool shots. I hope to show you guys in the next video coming up. But I never get tired of looking at this. And he just drove it. It's dirty, but it doesn't look that bad. You know, on camera, you really can't tell. No, on camera, you guys can't tell at all. It looks clean as shit. She a dirty girl. But she, she dirty. John, she John Perdue would be upset with you right now. He'd be like, that shit nasty as fuck. <laughs> He'd be like, you, you asshole. You asshole. But no, I mean, that was fun. I had a good time. Well, could you, you, do you enjoy driving a real car for once? Did it have a turbo? No, 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 no. The, the bullshit. This guy was smiling ear to ear. Smiling ear to ear. Forever he, K-Series. Forever k He likes being slow, so he doesn't know any better right now. I, like, well, I would say... And owning two K series. See, in bulk is defense. In bulk is defense. This thing would sound nasty and pull hard with a boosted K series. Did you put a big turbo on this? Do the same thing. Come on, Mo. Uh, v Tech. V, not v Tech. You're talking K series. You're redlining like 8,600 easy, maybe nine grand. What are you redlining this thing? 7,250. Oh, 72. Gotta get the girl, get the old girl, stretch her legs a little yeah. bit. Gotta let the girl run like cheetah. K series cheetah. I'll tell you what, I rode in it with Volca. It definitely feels it's quick for, I mean, what, it's fun. what little you have done to it. It's definitely a fun little car. 
A little snail down there. A little snail. It pops and crackles. So what do you got done to yours? Um, M52 swap, ARP head studs, .140 head gas draw and drops. Turbo! GT35R. Sweet. Yeah. Untuned. Pop Maybe the hood on that. That's actually really cool. It's got big old turkey on it. Yeah, let's go pop the hood. And it's functional. Hey, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> more bang doors? <laughs> what water? It's funny because I remember, I remember looking at this, you were at Chambers Bird Cars and Coffee with us the last time, right? I think. I'm not sure. It breaks down. I love that hood, how it does that. <laughs> but boom. I gotta redo that. I gotta wrap it whenever the header's off the car. That looks like ass. Yeah. A lot of sleeper. It is a sleeper. I love sleeper cars. Sounds so good too. It's awesome. It's tight fit though, man. Like, looking at this here, she's a tight fit. Why is it every girl that gets on freaking YouTube, it's just so easy for them? And it's like, boop, 10,000 subscribers. They got boobs and a butt. Boobs and a butt. We just need a set of boobs, boobs and, a and a butt. butt. Been a good day. Good, good day. He's about to help me out. This shit is going to make your car. Hmm. This thing is dirty. Ryan's about to hook a brother up. There's one, two, three, four, five Toyotas. Well, that about wraps it up. Had a blast. Thanks for yeah, having me. Yeah, had a good me. time, man. This was fun. Say hi to Kat. Hi. I think it's aiming at her, I'm not sure. But yeah, as always, such a blast. The ride home's gonna suck, but uh. Well, at, least, at least today was good. Like, it was a good day. Like, we got a fuck ton done. And it didn't rain for the first time in forever. Yeah, it yeah. actually held out pretty good, so. Well. Until next time, guys, signing out.